Well, first of all, you were so charming. <laughs> Thank you. That I decided I'm going to do a good job. Yes, and you did. I have Dr. Varilov here. Yeah. Who has this new approach mm -hmm. to change the valve without opening the chest. Yeah. And this is exactly what I did. I called Dr. Love and he was very excited about it. And he says, it's going to be bread and butter. So Stephanie is the first person at Mount Sinai to receive uh, um, a device, a, a valve that's approved by the uh, Food and Drug Administration. What we were able to do is, uh, with her under anesthesia, just go from the top of the leg up through the heart with, uh, with a catheter. And then we put a wire out there that's a little stiff that, that holds, uh, holds things in place. And we mount the valve. It, the valve is mounted on a stent, which is a little metal cage and we squish the stent down onto a delivery system mm -hmm. and it has a little covering over it. And we put that in and, and the amazing part is, is we're able to thread that up to exactly the right place in the heart and then when it's in the right place we expand a balloon and that opens up the stent against the wall and then we bring the balloon down and the stent stays open against the wall and that's holding the valve in place. And it was really a very straightforward procedure uh, and Stephanie, um, the whole procedure from beginning to end was probably an hour and a half, um, maybe in that range. And um, she woke up right afterwards, and felt, uh, felt pretty well, yeah. a little bit of discomfort at the groin, I think uh, mm -hmm. you said, but, um, but was ready to go home the next day. And here we are uh, almost exactly a week later with, uh, yeah. with her feeling well. It was great. I mean, I went in, they pressed me up, I lay down, I woke up, and it was just like a little bit of pain in my groin area, but they took care of me wonderfully. I was happy. I went home. And I'm like kind of scared because for me, I'm usually feeling my heart kind of different. Like it's at a fast pace and I'm not doing anything. So I'm like feeling my heart kind of calm. I'm like, wait, my heart feels weird. It feels different. But I guess that's how it's supposed to be, calm and regular. So it, it went great. So we saw Stephanie back today and we did an ultrasound of the valve and she also saw Dr. Fuster and saw me mm -hmm. and listening, you can hear, you can hear the valve working. It works great, and by the ultrasound, um, we see that there's no narrowing and no leakage, and it looks perfect. And it sounds normal. It, like, if you was to listen to my valve, you wouldn't even know I had any type of problem or anything. It sounds the way it's supposed to sound, and it feels the way it's supposed to feel.